We've seen a lot of this lately. Watches stolen at gunpoint, drivers in expensive cars targeted, violent robberies on the rise here in Southern California. From those brazen smash and grabs to armed holdups, these heists are becoming more and more common. LA Police Chief Michael Moore says residents need to be on the lookout when they're out and about. KTLA's Mary Beth McDade live from the Miracle Mile with the latest on this disturbing crime trend. MB. Yes, you guys, and you know, just hours after Chief Michael Moore issued that warning, this Chinese restaurant over the Miracle Mile was robbed, and a, a watch jeweler up in his Hollywood Hills home was held up. Multiple demands of where's the backpack, where's the briefcase, so they knew what they knew what they were looking for. A high-end watch dealer says he was the victim of a home invasion robbery in the Hollywood Hills. He says around one Wednesday morning, four suspects pointed guns at him and demanded expensive watches. They zip tied my hands behind my back, and then they left out my patio door. And Tuesday, in the heart of Beverly Hills, in broad daylight, this a smash and grab robbery at a jewelry store. The owner tells us just before 2 p.m., five mass suspects showed up with sledgehammers, broke his front window, and took off with millions in jewels. I was sitting in my office and I heard what I thought was gunshots. So, uh, really loud, literally sounded like gunshots. I told my staff, I yelled out, everyone on the floor. And a violent follow home robbery in Culver City last week, where police say the suspects pulled a gun on two men and pistol whipped one of them before getting away with a Rolex and a phone. There's been a continued increase in the, in the frequency of robberies involving the use of a firearm. The LAPD police chief says robberies are up 18% compared to last year. And robberies involving firearms are up 44%. He says many of them involve victims wearing expensive jewelry. That with these increases, uh, that if they're going to wear expensive jewelry or as they uh, are involved in perhaps uh, driving high end cars, uh, leaving uh, uh, restaurants, uh, taverns, and other locations, that they be mindful of their surroundings. Some Angelinos feel that more needs to be done so that people can be safe on the streets. I mean, I'm the person who, like, I, I wear an expensive watch, and I hear, um, like, I've, I've heard politicians say, don't wear certain things outside, and I think that's BS, right? Like, you know, we pay taxes to live in a safe environment. Yeah, and the chief says that in order to help cut down on these violent crimes, that he's adding more personnel to a special task force that was created to cut down on these violent robberies. And he also says that, you know, if you are being robbed, that you should not resist because that person could have a gun and your pricey watch is not worth your life. 